Ha, huh, you're awesome and I believe in your dreams. Don't be defeated. Today, you're going to want to give up. There's a part of you that's going to want to give up. And it's okay. There are parts, especially in life, there are parts of life where you, it gets hard. It gets real tough and you're going to want to give up. Don't give up. Also, don't eat a half pound of uncooked crab meat. That's a different story. I'm reminded of the story of uh, a farmer, and I, I, I did do this on a live, uh, a live cast from yesterday, but I'm reminded of a story of a farmer who found an old eagle's nest. It was abandoned, and in it was an eagle's egg. And he wanted to see if he could, if he could hatch one, so he put it in with his chickens in his chicken coop. And uh, shortly thereafter, he had an eagle. He didn't want this eagle to fly away, so he clipped its wings and he put it with his chickens. But there's a couple differences for this eagle. And I really want you to relate this story to your life. The eagle, although surrounded by chickens, thought it was a chicken, but it didn't act like the chickens. It wouldn't put its head down to eat. It'd always look up. It was physically larger than the chickens. It didn't act like the chickens. And one day, some other eagles flew overhead and it saw it because it was looking up. And it saw that it was like those eagles. And it wanted to fly, but it couldn't. Its, uh, its feathers had been clipped. And so some time had passed, and the farmer had forgotten to clip its wings. And its, its feathers had grown back, and it climbed onto the top of the chicken coop. Because it knew it was no longer like those chickens, and it never was in the first place. It was like those eagles, those eagles flying high above it. And one day a storm was coming, and instinctively, it flew towards the storm, and it never came back to those chickens. Now, we get to a point in life where we accept normality where we are not normal. We accept falling into the crowd when we don't. Why? Because we have a specific purpose. But we want security, and security is in that crowd. What we don't understand is that outside of that crowd is where our future is. Outside of the normal is where we're normal. And that's where we need to be. And until you reach that place, until you take a step away from the crowd to see where you belong in life, you'll never belong. Not really. You'll be complacent. You'll be existing, not living. So I want you guys, and then trust me, that eagle had times where it just wanted to give up. When it couldn't fly, when he was missing those feathers, it was like, well, maybe I'm just going to stay here with those chickens. But the instinct took over. And you're going to feel this. You're going to feel this when you're not living up to your full potential. You're going to feel inside of you that there is a voice pushing you to go get your dreams. Listen to that voice. Go get your dreams. You're awesome. And I believe in your dreams. Don't give up. It is okay to have those thoughts. It doesn't mean you're weak. I, I mean, when I have 585 pounds on my back, when I'm doing a squat, I think like giving up. I think like I want to get this weight off of me. But I also think my muscles are going to grow if I just stand up with it. So I struggle through and I stand up. If you guys want to lift 585 pounds squat, come on out to Ragnarok. Oh, we're also selling these shirts, by the way. Go to www.ragnarokstrength.com and you can order these shirts. They're really comfortable and they fit everybody. 
Get your dreams. It's okay to doubt. Don't live in the doubt. You guys are awesome.